Cosby Show. Ben Grauer, ladies and gentlemen, greeting you on behalf of Edgar Bergen, Charlie McCarthy, Ray Noble and his orchestra, Anita Gordon, Mortimer Snurd, Ursel Twing, and our guest for the evening, Boris Carlo. Every time you're near a road, aren't you glad you've got a nose? with their musical version of The Breeze and I. Uh, 
yes. Charlie, why do you keep turning your face away from me like that? Oh, nothing. Never look at me. Uh, oh, oh. Uh, yes. <laughs> what makes your eyes so black? Well, the color of it. Yeah. <laughs> black is so smart this year, they say. Yes. Uh huh. And your coat's torn, too, all torn. Well, the buttonholes are still there. Yeah. <laughs> Fighting again. That's it. Fighting again, isn't it? Uh, yes, sir. Yes. Yes, it was. How do you manage to get into all this trouble? No, I don't know. I guess I just know the right people. <laughs> <laughs> well, out with it, young man. What was the cause this time? Well, sure, this is, this is a different story. Yes. It was my neck, sir. Your neck? Yes, I stuck it out too far. I do. <laughs> well, what's the story, Charlie? Come on now. And I want the truth, and I want it right now. And if you don't, why, you know what... Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. Don't get that woodshed look in your eyes. All right. Uh... I'll tell you, it's like this. Yes. I was, uh, I was walking down the street, see? Yes. There's no harm in that. No, no. <laughs> Thinking beautiful thoughts. Minding my own business. Yes. Well, that is unusual. Well, I soon got sick of it. Yeah, I met... <laughs> <laughs> All right, now proceed. And while you're telling the story, young man... Yes? I'll decide what your punishment should be. Yes. Punishment? Yes, yes. Well, now, I'll admit, Bergen, I was fighting. But it was for your honor. Your honor. I mean, Mr. Bergen. Uh, <laughs> that's a likely story. But it was, Mr. Bergen. It really was. You see, there was, there was a big bully twice my size. Yes. And he said certain things about you. So I just, I just couldn't stand it. I... I just let him have it. Mm -hmm. You mean he was telling lies about me? Yeah, worse than that, he was telling the truth. Oh, I... <laughs> and you fought this big bully on my account? Yes, Mr. Bergen, that's just what I did. And I don't want, I don't want anyone to running you down. I guess that's just sentimental, but I just don't want anyone to run you down. I see. Except me. Yeah, I see. <laughs> Well, I do feel flattered that you stood up for me. Well, why shouldn't I? After all, Bergen, you're all I've got. Yeah, of course. It ain't much, but it's all I've got. <laughs> well, the important thing is, Charlie, you were a brave boy. Yes, that I was. To go after someone twice your size. Oh, you're so right, Bergen. <laughs> yes. I started out landing a couple of good ones. I bet you did. Then I was, uh, I was unexpectedly taken horizontal. I see. <laughs> Yeah. But you got right up again, didn't you? Yes, sir, I certainly did. Constantly. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I was up, I was down. I was down, I was up. Yeah. Yo-Yo McCarthy, they called me. <laughs> Why, you poor kid. Oh, it's nothing real, eh? Yeah. And then all of a sudden, I was wearing my nose pompadour. I see. <laughs> Why, you poor boy. Oh, it's nothing. Yeah. How is your nose now? I think it's taken its last blow. I see. <laughs> Charlie, you don't know how much I appreciate what you've done. Yeah. You know, Charlie, I feel closer to you now than I've ever felt before. Yeah. This, this means a great deal to me. Yeah? Yes. <laughs> I, I feel more like a father. Do you very? Yes. I, I feel closer to you too, Bertie. I guess I couldn't help myself. There. Yeah. I really believe that I believe that you're dearer to me now, Charlie, than, than at any time. <laughs> Very good. Yes, Charlie. You kissed me. All right. <laughs> yeah. But seriously, Charlie, I want to do something real nice for you now. What would you like? Well, I could be imposed upon to accept a banana split or two. Oh, yes. Yeah. No sooner said than done. Ray. Oh, yes. Ray, yes. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. oh I think Charles, old boy. <laughs> I see you think just a wee bit too much uh, eyeshadow. Yes. Boy. <laughs> now, don't be funny. This decoration I received on the field of battle. Oh, indeed. It's the purple orb. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, you certainly look funny, old thing. Uh, yeah. <laughs> How did it happen? Yeah, well, bend down and I'll show you. Oh, all right, now, never mind, Charlie. Ray, will you call a page boy? All oh, right, Hoeger, on the double. Yeah. Boy. Now, what would you like, Charlie? Well, I'd like a scoop of pineapple and tutti frutti mixed, and then a scoop of chocolate and pistachio. No, that won't do. The colors clash. I see. Yeah, yeah. Well, here's the boy now. Here I am, mister. Yes, good, good. Hi, you slugger. Huh? Hey, that show was one swell battle you and that kid done. Oh, you saw the fight? Yeah, I seen it all. 
Oh. Yeah, Ixne, Ixne, kid. Not so oddly, Ixne. <laughs> you got off lucky, Charlie. The other guy has two shinies. Yeah, you mean that big bully who said those mean things about Mr. Bergen, huh? Don't you, pal? I hope, huh? Yeah? <laughs> yeah. Nah, nah. I mean that little kid. That little kid? Yeah, the little kid with the cute thing you tried to swipe from me. <clears throat> Try to... That's all, brother. That's all. That's all. <laughs> Just a moment. So you weren't fighting after all, were you? It was over a girl. Yes. And you're still telling me lies in spite of all the punishment I've given you. Yes, yes. Okay, let's go to the woodshed. Give me the works. Pour it on. All right. And I'm going to, too. But I just want you to know one thing, Bergie. This has taught me a lesson. Well, I hope it has. And what have you learned from this? Well, after all these years with you, Bergen, I have found that if I, if I try hard enough... Yes, of course. I can still make an awful dope out of you. <laughs> You don't? No, I almost forgot I got, I got a misery. Oh, I see. Yeah. What kind of misery have you? Well, I got a headache in my tooth. You mean you have a toothache? Yeah, oh, yeah, I got a toothache, yeah. Well, that's too bad. Which tooth is it, Mortimer? Mm hmm? I say, which tooth is it? Well, it's, uh, it's, uh, <laughs> quiet, please. Which tooth is it? Well, don't tell me. Let me guess. All right. Yeah. <laughs> I think it's one of my cuspidors. No, 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 no. No, not cuspidor. Well, it's one I spit through. It is. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, yes, I see. Well, I see. Maybe it's a baby tooth. Well, I don't think so, no. I don't even have a baby. Oh, you don't have one. Well, I wish you'd told me sooner about this toothache. Well, I rapped at your door earlier this morning. You did? Yeah. Well, why didn't you ring my bell? Well, I didn't want to wake you up. Yeah, I, 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 <laughs> well, maybe I better look at your tooth. Do you mind? No, well, I'll open my mouth and you can browse around. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> open wide. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, oh. I can't see very well. Uh, your tongue is in the way. Oh, oh, yeah. Do you mind sticking your tongue out? Which end? We're all out. Say, that that is bad. That's very bad, Mortimer. Hmm? Don't you care for your teeth? Well, I don't care for them when they ache. No, I don't mind them. <laughs> don't you brush them regularly? Yep. Yeah. What about toothpaste? No, I don't believe in that stuff. You don't believe in that. <laughs> you can't paste a tooth back. Oh, no. <laughs> I suppose you know you should see your dentist twice a year? Oh, shucks, I see mine every day. Every day? Mm -hmm. I deliver papers there. Oh, I see. <laughs> Well, uh, Mortimer. Yeah, I'm Mortimer. Yeah, yeah. Right, right. <laughs> yeah. Well, ain't that dumb? No, no, I know. No. Yeah. Well, you know, I think I should take you to a dentist tomorrow. Let's see now. Where shall we meet? Well, let's see. Some place will be best, I think. Yeah, some place. <laughs> but when and where? Well, we can decide that when we get there. Yes, I think so. <laughs> so I've decided when we get there. Yeah. How can you be so stupid? Well, I reckon my wisdom tooth grew in backwards. 